So here how to do auto tuning on a ATV 900 30 Schneider. So first, go and simply start. Make sure all the parameters is matching with your motor, the power, the current, and the speed in RPM. Your max frequency, and you see auto tuning not done. So what you need to do after going to complete setting, command and reference, go all the way down, HME command disable. So you need to put bumpless so you get the control uh, from this button in local mode. So now I must go in local. You can see in the corner. Okay. Now I get the control from the HMI. I put the frequency I want, and if if I press start, the drive is starting. Okay. So this, I can do the rotation of my motor, check the rotation side. And once this is done, you go to simply start. And you go to auto tuning. And you go to apply auto tuning. Tell you motor is gonna move, but most of the time it doesn't move. And you press OK. Apply auto tuning in progress. You let it do it. Okay. Now you can see auto tuning done. So it's fine. And I go out from local mode to terminal so the PLC get the control back on it. If you shut down the frequency inverter and put it on again and you go to auto tuning, it will show not done, but it's actually done and, and saved in the VFD. So you don't have to do every time you shut it down.